Hello everyone, welcome back. This playlist is specifically designed for students who have not explored computer programming and I hope you find this playlist helpful in programming. So don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated if you find the video useful. In the previous video, we discussed about number system. In this video, let me explain to you how to convert binary number to its decimal form. So let us consider a binary number. Uh, let me take a small binary number 110. Let's see how do we convert this into its decimal form. Now when you consider a binary number, you should remember two things. Starting from right, the rightmost digit is called the least significant bit. So this is nothing but your least significant bit. And the leftmost one is called MSP. MSP is nothing but most significant bit. So the rightmost one is known as LSP which is a least significant bit and the leftmost one is called MSP the most significant bit. And each bit has an associated weight to it. Now always the weight starts from LSP that is your least significant bit. My least significant bit in this number is 0. So the weight of that, the weight begins from 0. So the weight of this is 0. Next it goes in incremental fashion incremented by 1. The next digit has or the next bit has a weight 1 and the next bit will have a weight 2. So this is how it is. Now to convert this into its decimal form, we will find the sum of product of each bit with 2 to the power of weights. I will tell you how is it. Now while performing the sum or the conversion, we will start from the most significant bit. My most significant bit is 1. So each bit I will multiply with 2 to the power of its weight. What is the weight of 1? It is 2. So I will multiply 1 with 2 to the power of its weight. Add it now. Take the second bit that is 1 again. Multiply it with 2 to the power of its weight. What is the weight of 1? Uh, the second bit that is 1. Plus take the third bit that is 0. Multiply it with 2 to the power of its weight. To its weight is 0. So it is 0. Now let us see. 1 into 2 to the power of 2. 2 to the power of 2 is 4 plus 1 into 2 to the power of 1 is 2. 0 into 2 to the power of 8, 0 is 1. Any number to the power of 0 is 1. So here 1 plus 4 is 4 plus 1 plus 2 is 2. 0 into 1, oh sorry, 1 into 4 is 4. 1 into 2 is 2 and 0 into 1 is 1. Sorry, 0 into 1 is 0. So 4 plus 2 is 6. So what is this 6? Is the decimal equivalent of this binary number 110. So to say that it is a decimal equivalent, we will place a base value to the number. So if I put within parenthesis 10, it means that this number is at in decimal form. If I put parenthesis 2, it means that this 110 is at in binary. It's in binary form. So 110 which is in binary form is same as 6 in its decimal form. So this is how you convert a binary number to decimal. Let's take another example. So I'll delete all this. Let's take another example. Let's take another number, a binary number 1010. When I say base 2, this is known as the base. 1010, if I include base 2, it means that it is in binary form. Now tell me what is the least significant bit. Let me take another color. Which is the least significant bit? This is the least significant bit. This is the most significant bit. So my weight will start from least significant bit. So this has a weight 0, 1, 2, 3. Now let's find the sum. So I'll for to find the decimal equivalent, I always start from MSP. 
that is my most significant weight it is 1 into 2 to the power of its weight that is 3 plus next bit is 0 0 into 2 to the power of its weight that is 2 plus next bit is 1 1 into 2 to the power of its weight to its weight is 1 so 1 plus 0 into 2 to the power of its weight is 0 so 1 into 2 to the power of 3 2 2 are 4 4 2 are 8 so 8 0 into 4 plus 1 into 2 plus 0 into 1 0 into 4 will get nullified 0 into 4 I mean 1 is again 0 so 1 into 8 is 8 0 into 4 is 0 1 into 2 is 2 plus 0 into 1 is 0 8 plus 2 is 10 10 you should specify the base of it to say that 10 is in decimal form so 1010 in binary form is equivalent to 10 in decimal form pretty easy right so this is how you convert any binary number to its decimal form and understand what that number signifies the way we handle data we handle data in decimal form so if you see a number in binary form we should understand okay this number signifies or is equivalent to our decimal form so uh, today's uh, video i explained to you how do you convert decim binary number to decimal number so in the next video we will learn how to convert decimal to binary that is in case i have a decimal number how do we convert it into binary and if you find this video useful please like the video and subscribe to the channel